Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. I welcome you all in the name of Jesus. This is Prophet Word with Adele. And if this is your very first time seeing me, you are welcome. If you have been part of the family, may God continue to bless you. Thank you so much, my returning subscriber, for always coming back. And if you're new, you are welcome to the family. I love you all in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Father, Lord, we give you all the adoration. We thank you, Holy Spirit of God, for there is none like you, Jesus. Father, we invite you to come in our midst. Give us the understanding to understand this message. Thank you, Father, for we cannot do without you. We cannot do without you, Holy Spirit. Take control of our lives and give us the right direction. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. God says, the thought you will not you could not make it this far but you are a fighter hmm. they thought you could not make it but you are a fighter hallelujah praise the name of the lord thank you jesus you know there are people that used to minimize you there are people that when they used to see you they say you will not make it when they look at you they they, 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 they say look at this one stalking in one position you cannot get out of that situation you, you will not make it but god is not man but you are a fighter you keep fighting you keep fighting this and God has brought you out of that situation. You see, when you're about to achieve your goal, do you think the devil will just let you just achieve it just like that? No. The devil is not giving you a chance. The devil is going to fight you so that you will give up. Because you are a fighter, you will not take no for an answer. You keep fighting. And God has answered your prayers. Hallelujah. I want us to look in the book of 2 Timothy chapter 4 verse 7. It says, I have done my best in the race. I have run the full distance and I have kept the faith. <laughs> Hallelujah. I have kept the faith. You have done your best. You have run the full distance and you have kept your feet. Hallelujah. You have, it means you have kept your feet. No matter the circumstances that come your way, no matter the difficulties that come your way, you have been running for a long distance. You have been running for a long distance. But you keep fighting. You keep fighting. You fight. And you have kept your faith. God loves people like this. God does not hesitate to bless people like this. This particular message is saying that no matter how difficult it is, no matter the pain, the stress, the frustration that you are going through, do not lose faith in God. God take just one second. I mean one second to change your life. God take just one second to turn your story around. He take just one second to make things right. People that used to look at you and say you will not make it in life. There are people that they will definitely go down in prayers just to pray that you should not make it in life, that you should Talk in that same position. There are people that pray evil for other people. But you run this distance for a long time. But you still keep your faith. God is working something beautiful for you. God is working something very good for you. He will not frustrate you. When his time comes, whether the devil like it or not, the devil cannot do anything. I said he cannot do anything. 
the devil is just wasting his time. When you have faith in God, trust me, things will not stay long in your life, they'll start manifesting. There are people that you have struggled, you have struggled, you have talked to God, you have prayed, just at the appointed time that you're about to receive your breakthrough, you give up. And then you start saying that, I've been praying for a long time, God has not answered my prayer, oh God is not answering my prayers. No. When you are praying, when you make up your mind that you need this thing and you want this thing from God, and when you start praying, never stop praying. You have to keep praying. God is going to make it happen for you in the mighty name of Jesus. God is going to give you your dream. God is going to do it for you. The way he do it for Esther in the Bible. God is going to do it for you. The way he do it for Ruth in the Bible. He promised can never fail and he promised will never fail in your life. Always remember that. He promised will never fail in your life. The Bible says, still 2 Timothy chapter 4, verse 8. And now there is waiting for me the victory price of being put right with God. The victory price to be put right with God. After fighting this fight, after struggling for a long time, God reward for you. Your victory is coming. He reward for you is going is is going to be powerful. He reward for you is going to be mighty. You are going to enjoy God. You are going to enjoy God's world. It, it is better to be patient and pray and wait for God's world to manifest in your life than to go to the wrong direction. You know, when the devil gives you something in the right hand, he collects it back in the left hand. But when God gives you something, nobody can take it away from you. In the mighty name of Jesus, let us pray. Father, Lord, we thank you. We worship you. We give you all the praise. Father, I pray that whoever that come across this message, let this person never give up on their dreams. Let them keep fighting the fight and keep running the run and keeping the faith. In the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Now, may the good Lord keep you. May he cause his face to shine on you. May he give you peace in Jesus' name. If you're finding this video useful, please don't forget to give a thumbs up, turn on the notification bell, and hit on the subscribe button. Stay blessed.